Hello everyone, and welcome back to some more Blue Bells on the channel. Hope you guys are all having a fantastic day, as usual. I thought what I would do for this episode, or for day today's episode, was to not make like a very long episode, but I just wanted to make it long enough so I could go over all of the patch notes, so I didn't have to, so you guys didn't have to have the trouble of going out to actually like read all through them. I thought I'd just provide them for you guys. So there is a uh, there was changes to powers as well as bug fixes. Um, I will go over all of them. And I'll probably I'll kind of like say my point of view on them. Um, not that that matters, but <laughs> I'll just say that anyways. So a lot of the upgrades were made. Uh, the ones that I like kind of popped out to me were the uh, glue. So with the regular monkey glue, the pierce went from 50 to 40, um, meaning the uh, popping power of the lots of glue, which was like the uh, fourth. Was, which is when you get four glue. It was the one right before, I believe, acid. Um, and the pierce, or the popping power for that, also went down from 100 to 80. Um, then the monkey acid, um, the monkey acid went from uh, went from like four uses to three, which I'm fairly sure it was four, it was three already. Uh, I'm not really sure about that. Um, I was a little confused about that part. Um, if you guys could like let me know or uh, like correct me on that, I would I would love that. I love to be corrected. Um, that's not being sarcastic. So the um, popping power of the monkey ass did go down quite a bit, almost half, because um, it was at 50, which down, went down to 30 um, popping power. Um, so I did see. I'm actually pretty happy about this update because there was a lot of people that were, um, which is why they also probably changed it. Was there was a lot of people. Um, who were like saying that they would all out rush and then someone would just put down then the opponent would just put down monkey asses and stop the entire rush with like one or two um, so I do like that that the popping ability of that monkey ass did go down um, the range boost attack speed um, I'm not really sure the range boost attack so there um, I'll probably I might show it on the screen, um, but there was a range boost. Yeah, I will. I definitely will because I want to. I want to kind of show you guys what they're actually talking about, just in case you don't know. Um, so the range boost attack speed bonus went from 20% to 50%, which is quite a big jump. Um, I haven't used that um, power very much, um, so I wouldn't have much input on it yet. But uh, I will. I'll probably use it in the future. I'll unlock it and probably use it next episode just to kind of see kind of how it works and. Uh, how good it is. So that did go up by quite a bit. Um, but I, I will probably be using that in future episodes because I do not have much use, I have much uh, knowledge of what that kind of is. Um, the power XP earned um, in each arena, or like the uh, the XP that you can get um, before, you could go to the lower arenas and kind of grind the XP. But now the XP is earned based on like what arena you're playing in, uh, which I also think is really cool because like. You can't just get the insanely easy XP now by going to the lower levels. Um, now on to bug, bug fixes. Um, a lot of these I don't know what they are, but I will still kind of um, show you guys or um, explain them to you guys just to kind of like if, for example, if you guys use these or if you guys have had problems with these, I just kind of want to make them clear that they have been fixed. Um, I, I've never had problems with most of these, but. Um, they apparently fixed regen balloon cost multiplier. Um, I mean, I don't really want to speak much about that because I don't really, I haven't had, I am not really sure what that is, so I kind of just want to make it clear as I said before. Um, the tower boost power does not, or is, uh, does not target MOABs. That was a bug, and that was um, fixed. Again, for most of these, I'm not, I haven't used them. Um, I'm just kind of stating them and kind of um, telling you guys what these are all about just so you guys can actually know these have been fixed. Um, the tower mega boost also applying regular tower power ooh, tower power, that's kind of cool, to uh, towers. The um, fixed a crash spectating card battles. I'm not really sure what that means, but um, for those of you that do, that was fixed. Um, the UI or like the placement, uh, I'm assuming, as you guys can probably see on the screen, the powers um, were switched around. The like your your battle energy or your popping um, or your damage. What am I trying to say? Your damage booster, I guess you could call it. Um, and your kind of uh, or with in my case, I have the damage boost and the monkey acid. Those are both swapped. Um, 
And it says that they're uh, swapped for non-widescreen phones. Um, so I guess that just makes it easier to kind of maneuver around and to use those things on mobile. Um, the Monkey Apprentice Chain Lightning not affected by damage boost tower power. I actually did experience that one a bit. Um, so like the Monkey Apprentice um, didn't, like the, the Lightning, it didn't like go off quicker as, of, from what I'm assuming. Um, I did use... I, I didn't really notice this bug much, but um, I, I've heard of people that did. Um, but the Monkey Apprentice Chain Lightning, or like the lightning that goes off, is not affected by damage boost. So I'm assuming that it, it doesn't do more damage, but it was still... I'm not sure if the lightning went off more, or um, or it just doesn't pop as much balloons. I'm not really sure about that, but um, the village... Okay, these two I actually am I'm pretty experienced with. The village um, that had its range boosted, not affecting towers within its new range. Um, with that one, I know I keep saying I've experienced these, but with that one I did not. Um, but with the dartling gun next to the village, I did actually, I didn't experience this, but I've seen people experience it, so I know quite a bit about it. Um, so basically, the problem with that was where... If you had the um, dartling gun next to a monkey village, there was an upgrade on the monkey village that you could get to where the dartling gun could um, fire extra missiles, which made this insanely good, especially with the... Um, I'm a, it was, a, it was a, an ability, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I think you could also get another... You could get, actually, I think, two upgrades of monkey village, one that sped it up, and then, like, a boost, uh, or, like, um, an ability that also... Um, like, provided the uh, dartling guns with extra um, extra missiles, which the missiles you get from actually upgrading the right section of the dartling gun all the way, um, and it shoots missiles. And uh, that I, I know that upgrade, or that bug was doing a lot of damage, because you could insta-kills, oh my god, and stuff, not insta-kill them, but you could kill them very quickly. So I'm very glad those were fixed, and uh, that does wrap up all of the uh, power chains and bug fixes. But what I really do like about the game developers as well is they said, let us know your thoughts in the comments below and happy gaming. I really like that because they are seriously taking the community, what the community is saying, into the game and uh, kind of changing it based off that. So I really do um, love the game de developers for doing that. And this is a great game. Um, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Hope it wasn't too boring. Um, hope you still enjoy the uh, gameplay and bit of information about the things that were changed in the new update but apart from that i hope you guys did enjoy thank you so much for watching and as always i'll see all you beautiful people in the next episode